glad to be here this morning. Glad to be over here in Harlan, Kentucky. I thought the preacher preached so good to you this morning. Preaching, thank God. And I was thinking he's here preaching. As a boy come to me one time at work and said, Preacher, he said, I can pray any time I want to. Oh, God. He said, I can get to God. I can pray any time I want to pray. Oh, God. I said, oh, no, son. No, you can't. I said, you can't come to Jesus except that Father draws you. Except you feel that move upon you, thank God, and draw you down. There ain't no way you can get to him. You can't find him. You can't get to him. he got a Father got to draw you. you got to feel a drawing. Get in your heart. you got to feel a drawing. Get in your life, thank God, and let you know, thank God, it's time to come home. Time to go down to the altar. I thought this morning just feel like giving my testimony a little bit. I, I thought as I when I was a young boy, I went there right up and down Kentucky 38 to Wayne, and I didn't even know that they was a true God. I didn't know that they was a living God. Till one day, thank God, a friend of mine, and he told me, he said, go to church with me. And he kept a begging me, he said, go to church with me. And I told him, I said, if you leave me alone, I'll go with you one time. And I thought that night the way I went to that church house and oh Henry Long began to preach and there was something begin to move on me. Yeah, and yeah. there was something begin to get on me. Yeah, and I didn't even know it existed. Yeah. I didn't even know they did such thing like that. Yeah. He got that in my heart, he got in my life. Yeah. He got in my heart, begin to run up and down my spine. And Doug, I looked around and they wouldn't know where to go. I tried to run, but I couldn't run. And I found myself down at the altar. I cried out to God. Well, glory. You can't get to God any time you want to. You can't pray any time you want to. You fool around and put it on too late. You fool around and you wait too late. Well, glory. It's dangerous to wait. Preachers, it's dangerous. Lay member prophets, a sinner man, it's dangerous. And they keep on putting it all. When this man keeps on a dealing, he keeps on a calling, he keeps on a drawing you down to all the prayer. It's a dangerous thing to walk away from it. Preacher, there's a cut now, please. There's a cut now. Place. Yeah, oh God, there's a place you go when God will cut you off. Hallelujah, well, glory. I thought what Tom Dubershaw told me. He said I went to pray for a man, and I got down to pray, and that man the tears was running out of his eyes, and the dipping off his cheeks, and he said, Preacher, I'm a want to get saved, and I can't get saved. Well. And never said I got down beside the bed and I begin to pray. And he said the spirit spoke to me and said there's no use for you to pray. He sealed it to Well glory. Hallelujah. And you can put it off too late. You can wait too late. Well glory. And when you quit feeling that draw, yeah. Well glory. And my mind goes back to Samson. Hallelujah. When he finally kept a fooling around, he fooled with the enemy. He laid his hand in the line of love. He kept a fooling with the world. Well, glory. And in a while, he finally got the world the woman fell out. A worry straight line. Well, glory. And she called him barber. And he shaved off the seven locks of his hair. Well, and I can hear that one with the way. Arise, the Philistines in the boat, yeah. And old Samson jumped off. He thought everything was all right. Well, glory. But when he shook himself, the spirit had departed. And he was just like a normal man. He didn't have no strength. He didn't have no joy. He didn't have no hope. Well, glory. Hallelujah. You keep on. Take it fly. Well, morning. Hell is day after day. Day after day. 
Yeah. Oh, it seemed like it's him and revived this morning. Yeah. Day out of day, I'm walking down the road. Has spirit of dealing with you. Has spirit of knocking at your heart. Oh, and you yeah. cast it to the side. Yeah. Where well, can I preach out, Bill? Yeah. And it's going to be when the cancer sets on you. What's it going to be when the disease is getting up on your body? Oh, yeah. And you fool around. Yeah. And they call on God. Yeah. And you fool around. And it comes time that you need the Lord. And you put him off and put him off. And what are you going to do? Hell, it ain't coming a time. Hell, I don't know if time will last. Hell, I have no idea. Hell, I don't know what will happen in the future. Hell, God knows the future. I like to tell you this morning, life is uncertain. But death is sure. Death is coming to my house. Death is coming to your house. And if you ain't made preparation, if you ain't sought the Lord, if you ain't got him in your heart, if you ain't got him in your life, hallelujah, I look down in the songs of Solomon, and when he went about the city, I seek him, I have his soul of him, and he went a little way, and he saw the watchman, and he said, have you seen him, who my soul? But it's not in the world. 